scariest versions of a player. Let me give you someone more scary than any of this. 2014 Gary Ablett. 2014 Gary Ablett was the best player I have ever seen play the game. Okay, and for those who have ball knowledge, for those who remember those days, this man was on track to break Brownlow records. He was carrying Gold Coast to the finals. Gold Coast was solidified in the finals. And then it was like round 14 or something. The tackle, Brent McCaffer, Collingwood, tackles Ablett, fucks his shoulder. And then Ablett goes on to not play another game for that season. And Gold Coast win one of their last like seven games. That, that Gary Ablett is scarier than any of these players, okay? Just just scarier than Dusty, Dusty in the finals, because fuck me, that man, that man prime is more scary than danger. That man in 20, finals Dusty in this realm of nine players is, is the scariest, okay? But Gary Ablett in 2014, fuck me. He, you could not stop him. Taggers couldn't stop him. Crowley couldn't stop him. You couldn't do anything. You had to pray. You had to hope that he just wouldn't have a good game. And that would never happen. Look at the Brownlow votes in 2014. Look at how many he got before he got injured. Here we go. I've got it up on my laptop. He goes, in the 15th round, he had accumulated 22 votes. Round 16, 17, 8. He got injured in round 16. So 16, he didn't really play. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, June 2, 23. Eight matches, he missed out effectively a third of the season. And he was on track to poll 33 to 36 votes, something like that. That man was on smoke. On smoke, okay? Never disrespect Gary Ablett again. What is James Sicily doing here? Dreadlock Pendles was good, but he wasn't fucking amazing. Prime Danger, he still can't kick. 2015-5, yeah, he was actually fucking good. Showdown Grey, there were many good showdown players. Lockdown Neil, it's lockdown. Pfft, does it count? <laughs> That's what everyone says. Fucking Bandage Selwood, I argue you just turned into a more courageous person. And Elliot in the fourth quarter, we've seen plenty of good fourth quarter players, okay? Okay. 